Good day, everyone. My name is Marie. How are you? It's been a long time. I know you must be feeling great. I'm also feeling great. Well, today we are going to have a new topic. But first, I have something to ask. What is your favorite season? Do you like spring, summer, winter, or autumn? Well, in the Philippines, we only have two seasons. And you know, it is getting hotter, so yeah, the dry season is going to roll around. So, shall we continue with this? Okay, so you must. See this picture. It is so beautiful. So, what is it made of? Is it made of ice? Yes, it is. Well, our topic is entitled Winter Wonders. So, when you hear the two words winter and wonders, what is the first thing? That crosses your mind. Well, I think I know what that is. That would be cold, white. Well, there are so many words in our minds right now, especially when we hear winter wonders. So I have to show you something. Take a look at this picture. Okay, we can say that it is beautiful. The street is busy. Actually, this is where a festival is being held every year. But do you know where this place is? Oh, okay. It's okay if you don't know. But. This is a kind of park, and this is where a festival, let's just say winter festival, is being held. And I'm sure you have heard of the word festival. Okay, what is the meaning of festival? Okay, when you say festival. Okay, it's in the chat window. Okay, festival. It is an organized set of special events, such as musical performances or plays, usually happening in one place, or a special day or period, usually in memory of a religious religious event, with its own social activities. Food or ceremonies. Okay, so that is what we call a festival. So, in your country, do you have one? I am sure you have a lot of festivals in your own country. So, shall we read this article now? Winter. Wonders. Okay, I will start reading, or I will read it now. When the weather is cold, people love to visit Saint Paul, Minnesota. The city has a giant winter festival. The festival has been taking place each year for more than one hundred years. Everyone is invited to join the fun. Okay, so if we think about it, this kind of festival has been happening for more than one hundred years. And do you know what it means? It means that people love to celebrate, or Have a party, especially outside their houses. 
Okay, so if you can see it here, the word here is giant, and then winter, and the last is festival. So it has a giant winter festival. So shall we go back to the picture? Actually, this is what they call Rice Park. Okay, so this is the place where you can find in St. Paul. St. Paul, Minnesota can be found in the USA. So this is beautiful and it's also historic. And it is the center stage for the St. Paul Winter Carnival or Festival. Would you like to be in this place? Okay, so let's go back to the article. Okay, below there is a caption. There are ice sculptures. Okay, this is what we call a, an ice sculpture. Okay, I will read it now. Artists carve animals and other creatures out of ice. This is an eagle. It has a dream catcher. If you notice, the word that, uh, that is highlighted here is the word carve. And it means to make something by cutting into, especially wood or stone, or sometimes ice. Okay, so let's use the word in a sentence. Okay, the single piece of object is carved from a tree trunk. Okay, so before we go, I have some questions. Okay, where is the giant winter festival being held? The answer is St. Paul, Minnesota. And how long is this festival being held? Or do people have this kind of festival? Well, it's more than 100 years. Thank you for listening. It's already time, so I have to say goodbye now. My name is Marie. Thank you for listening. Goodbye.